Say good night, Manuel. You cannot silence the truth. My voice must be heard. Oh! Oh, oh my God! What did you do? Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. And we're back with more of the original Mass Effect. This is Hill. And just to recap, in our last episode, we created our main character, Sindarius Shepard. And we um, received a distress signal. And we are now on the planet Eden Prime to check out that signal, the source, and find out what's going on. There was some sort of menacing, monstrous ship that looked like it was attacking the planet. Let's see what we can do to help. What the hell are those? Gas bags. Don't worry, they're harmless. Got him now. But could you imagine those things? I mean, they're they're kind of scary looking. Could could you imagine coming out of your house and seeing creatures like that? All right, so we have an armor upgrade for motorized joints and shock absorbers. Reduce this to Omni Gel because I don't think I have any slots left in this starter armor set that I'm wearing, this N7 armor. Which, uh, you know, you quickly outgrow. I think just on this mission alone, you can find some better armor, and it's a shame because this is one of the, the, you know, iconic and better looking armors. It's a shame that you have to give it up so soon. But I'm going to hold on to it for this mission. Oh God, what happened here? No, it doesn't look like anything happened. Come on, let's go. Wait. some sabotage. Thank you. Alright, we have someone coming in close to me. I'm using throw. Alright, good work. Clear. Alright, it looks like we have a man down over here. Wow, I think he's permanently down. It's a shame that this beautifully retextured armor didn't offer him any protection at all. Rip right through his shields. We're at a chance. Leave him. We need to finish the mission. Aye, aye, sir. All right, we got some more renegade points, and uh, as you probably know, we are playing as a renegade character, so he is going to say some very crass rude things, hurt people's feelings, all that kind of stuff. Because that's just who he is. Caden, if you're ready, I think it's time for some more sabotage. Let's 
see if I can hit him with war. Got it. I've got some burned out buildings here, Shepard. A lot of bodies. I'm gonna check it out. I'll try to catch up with you at the dig site. Another upgrade kit, and we have a combat sensor. We'll take that. Let's see, let me switch to my assault rifle. disturbed if I saw these things. I'm sorry, I know they're harmless, but still. Uh-oh, uh-oh, Caden. something else for us to pick up. Again, these, these textures, this texture mod really, really makes this game look fantastic for it being as old as it is. Alright, we got a med kit. We got some metagel. We need to come in here and help her. I have an untrained weapon. I have... Alright, the game has given me bad information because I do have assault rifle training. I got it from playing through as a soldier. Alright, let's talk to this woman here. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. You the one in charge here, sir? I need a status report. Now. Oh, man. We were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. Any idea what kind of enemy we're facing? I think they're Geth. The Geth haven't been seen outside the Vale in nearly 200 years. The Perseus Vale? They must have come for the beacon. The dig site is close, just over that rise. It might still be there. Lieutenant Olenko and I will take care of this. Let me come with you, sir. The Geth slaughtered my unit. Give me a chance to get even. She knows the area, Commander. And we could use the extra firepower. Just don't forget who's in charge. Understood, Commander. You give the orders and I'll follow them. Describe what happened leading up to the attack. We were sent out a couple of nights ago from the main colony to secure the area. Seemed like a routine patrol, until the Geth hit us. We never knew they were coming. 
What happened to the researchers at the dig site? I don't know. They set up camp near the beacon. The 232 was with them. Maybe their unit fared better than mine. Tell me everything you know about the beacon. They were doing some digging out here to extend the monorail and expand the colony. A few weeks ago, they unearthed some Prothean ruins. And the beacon. Suddenly every scientific expert in the colony was interested. That's when they brought us in to secure the site. I don't know much about the beacon itself, but I heard one of the researchers say this could be the biggest scientific discovery of the century. What else do you know about the Geth? Just what I remember from history class back in school. They're synthetics, non-organic life forms with limited AI programming, created by the Quarians a few centuries ago. They were supposed to be a source of cheap labor, but ended up turning on the Quarians and drove them into exile. Well, after that, they just kind of disappeared behind the Perseus Veil. Nobody's really heard much from them since. Move out. Okay, we have a new assault rifle. The Banshee 3. Let's take this. Alright, so press start to bring up the mission computer and select equipment. To access the equipment screen, this allows you to switch and modify the weapons, armor, and other items used by your squad. Let's go to the equipment screen now. Alright, let's go ahead and switch out with this better rifle here. And I think we can uh, we may have some upgrades. A weapon sensor. Okay. Take that. As far as this old rifle, we'll go ahead and reduce this to Omni Gel. I think we're good. All right, I think there's some crates over here. Let's see what we've got. The beacon's at the far end of this trench. Armor-piercing rounds and phasic rounds. I will take them. And let me go ahead and equip these. see these are 15% damage versus synthetics since we're dealing with synthetics I will absolutely take this all right um I don't know does any of my other squad I don't have anything else for them okay and let's see what's in this crate scorpion one armor and I believe that is probably better than the armor that I've got on but let's go ahead and give this to Caden Smells like smoke and death. Yeah, look at this. The Scorpion damage protection 12 compared to the 5 on the Onyx armor that he's currently wearing. Alright, so we've switched that out. And let's go ahead and get rid of the uh, Onyx armor. Look at the shields. See, the shields are high. Biotic protection is high. See, I, I need to be wearing this because I'm, I'm wearing this Onyx armor. Okay, let's uh, Omni Gel it. Alright, squad, let's move. Oh, let me uh, do a save too. this untrained weapon. I don't know why the game doesn't seem to recognize that I have assault rifle training. Anyhow, uh, I guess we're going to keep moving. I thought the tutorial... Alright, crouch. I thought the tutorial had me telling my squad mates where to go. I guess not. Maybe I remember this incorrectly. Over there!
Take some sabotage, Caden. Good work. Alright, I'm gonna have them move up. Still another one. All right, they're all down. Perimeter secure. Decent work, people. Decent work. All right, what's in this crate over here? All right, we have shotguns, and none of us use shotguns, so it's Omni Gel. Omni gel time, and let's see. We need to go over here and investigate the dig site. This is the dig site. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By who? Our side or the Geth? Hard to say. Maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp. Let's get moving. Williams, where's the camp? It's just on the top of this ridge, up the ramps. Change of plans, Shepard. There's a small spaceport up ahead. I want to check it out. I'll wait for you there. All right. Billowing smoke is never a good sign after an alleged attack. And we've got fire, too. Looks like they hit the camp hard. It's a good place for an ambush. Keep your guard up. Oh, God. They're still alive. What did the Geth do to them? I think we are about to find out. Okay. Will you stop with the untrained weapon? Oh, shit. Look out. Look out, people. Here it comes. Caden Sabotage. It's not down yet. Let me try warp. Still not down. People. Okay. Got more. Caden, I think it's time for some throw. Good work. Okay, we got them. So, I let me get some brief comments. Eden Prime will never be the same again. Yeah, thank you. Ashley. Thank you. Thank you for the comments. Okay, let's see. I think there was something over here. Yes, upgrade kit. Turian armor. Since there's no Turian in our squad yet, we will Omni Gel it. Okay, we've got another crate here. Sniper rifle and heaven, ugh, heavy armor. Um, well, we'll take this. Ashley, this could actually be better than what she's got. Let's see. Wow, look at the difference. 33 damage protection. Oh, no biotic uh, or tech protection, though. 84 shields. What does this thing look like? Wait, I can't upgrade it. Why not? Oh, she doesn't... Oh, I have to unlock the ability for her to wear heavy armor. Okay, I got you. Got you. I do remember that. 
Okay, let's uh, keep going. That door, it's closed. Security locks engaged. And this um, controller mod that I installed doesn't seem to cover these puzzles, so I gotta switch back to my keyboard to get through this. Ah! Oh, come on. Wow. Okay, this is not going to be that easy, is it? Yeah, we got it. Okay. Thank you. Humans, thank the Maker. Hurry, close the door before they come back. How did you end up in this shed? We hid here during the attack. They must have come here for the beacon. Luckily it wasn't here. It was moved to the spaceport earlier this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to pack up the camp. When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. They gave their lives to save us. No one is saved. The age of humanity is ended. Soon, only ruin and corpses will remain. Can you tell me anything about the beacon? It's some type of data module from a galaxy-wide communications network. Remarkably well preserved. It could be the greatest scientific discovery of our lifetime. Miraculous new technologies, groundbreaking medical advances. Who knows what secrets are locked inside? We have unearthed the heart of evil. Awakened the beast. Unleashed the darkness. Manuel, please. This isn't the time. And you may think that the man is insane, but he knows exactly what he's talking about. Did you notice a Turian in the area? I saw him. The Prophet. Leader of the enemy. He was here, before the attack. That's impossible. Nihilus was with us in the Normandy before the attack. He couldn't have been here. I I'm sorry. Manuel's still a bit... unsettled. We haven't seen your Turian. We've been hiding in here since the attack. What else can you tell me about the attack? It all happened so fast. One second we were gathering up our equipment, the next we were hiding in the shed while the Geth swarmed over the camp. Agents of the Destroyers, bringers of darkness, heralds of our extinction. We could hear the battle outside, gunfire, screams. I thought it would never end. Then everything went quiet. We just sat there. Too afraid to move until you came along. What's wrong with your assistant? Manuel has a brilliant mind, but he's always been a bit unstable. Genius and madness are two sides of the same coin. Is it madness to see the future? To see the destruction rushing towards us? To understand there is no escape? No hope? No. I am not mad. I'm the only sane one left. I gave him an extra dose of his meds after the attack. Say goodnight, Manuel. You cannot silence the truth. My voice must be heard. Oh! Oh my god! What did you do? That might have been a little extreme, Commander. You can't just go around whacking people in the head! I saw Commander Shepard smirk. I don't know if you guys caught that. It was only a matter of time until he did something crazy. And dangerous. I suppose you're right. By the time he wakes up, the meds will have kicked in. Williams, take us to the spaceport. Good luck, Commander. Wow, I got nine renegade points for that? That's great. So yeah, this is playing as a renegade, I mean it, it just it's very entertaining. You know, so, sometimes the, the decisions might seem heartless and whatnot. But I just find the Renegade options to be a lot more fun. And the the Paragon ones, I mean, you know, you get to be a hero and do the right thing and I guess feel good about yourself. But for me, it's Renegade and Ruthless. That's just the way to go. It really makes the game a lot more enjoyable for me. This is one of the scenes I don't like to watch.
Saren. Nihilus. This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The Council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Don't worry. I've got it under control. Alright, so Nihilus is down. What is that? Off in the distance. Squad make Jenkins. Ashley, if only that was just a ship. Stay alert. Yeah, this uh this weapon definitely I feel like it's almost completely untrained, but I don't know if the, I can't remember if I put any points in there. I'm gonna have to check this out. When this fight is over with. Alright, we need some sabotage, Caden. And this guy here. There we go. Nothing like warping an explosive canister. Looks like we're clear. Think we got him, Commander. I think so too. Okay, let's uh there's a shelter over here. Let's go check this out. Looks like we've got a crate with our name on it. Alright, some Omni Gel. Alright, we got some more decryption here. God. Everybody stay calm out there. We're coming out, we're not armed. Is it safe? Are they gone? Nobody moves a muscle until we know who you are. Nice going, Cole. I told you we should have stayed hidden. It's okay. We're all on the same side here. We're just farmers. We've been hiding ever since that ship first showed up. Tell me everything you remember about the attack. The three of us were working the crops when that ship showed up. We just saw it and ran. I don't know what happened to the rest of the crew. They were by the garage, over near the spaceport, right where that ship came down. No way they survived. You don't know that! We survived! If they made it to the garage, they could have had a fighting chance! Do you know anything about the Prothean beacon they dug up? We're just farmers. We heard they found something out there, but it never really mattered to us. Not until now. What else can you tell me about the ship you saw? I was too busy running to get a clear look at it. <laughs> running? I think it landed over near the spaceport. <laughs> tell them about the noise, Cole. That awful noise! It was emitting some kind of signal as it descended. It sounded like the shriek of the damned. Only... it was coming from inside your own head. It was probably trying to block communications. Whatever it was, I felt like it was tearing right through my skull. It almost made it impossible to think. I have to go. Hey, Cole, we're just a bunch of farmers. These guys are soldiers. Maybe we should give them the stuff. Jeez, Blake, you gotta learn when to shut up. If there's something you're not telling me, some guys at the spaceport were running a small smuggling ring. Nothing major. In exchange for a cut of the profits, we let them store packages in our sheds. You greedy bastard. You weren't running for your life. You were running to check on your merchandise. No, it's not like that. I just I just knew there were some packages here. Something we could use. I found a pistol. 
Figured it would come in handy if those things came back. But they'll probably get more use out of it than we will. Uh-oh. Renegade option. I'm only gonna ask this once. Think long and hard before you lie to me again. Are you sure all you've got is one lousy pistol? Uh... <laughs> no, no, wait. I just remembered. <laughs> I, I just had it in my pocket. Might as well take in that in too. In your pocket? That's everything, really. Okay. Who's your contact at the spaceport, Cole? What's his name? He's not a bad guy. I don't want to get him in trouble. Besides, I'm not a snitch. Uh-oh. Renegade. Would you rather be a snitch or a corpse? Powell. His name's Powell. No honor among thieves. That's all I know, really. Not, not when you have a gun so in your face. Try to keep things friendly from here on in, okay? Mm, right. Yeah, we'll do that. I have to go. Good luck. Okay, so we got some renegade points, and we got a stinger pistol and a combat sensor. Oh, that... I guess it was the sensor that was in his pocket. We'll take those. And let's just check out the structure here. Um, we might need to do some upgrades, though, first. Let's see here. Wow, six points? Alright, let's have full intimidation. Oh, see, I've got nothing in assault rifles. That's why I can't hit a broadside of a barn here. Um, we... Give me some barrier. I need some kind of protection. Let's, uh... Huh. I don't know if I want shield boost. Let's... Let's try to get some accuracy in our rifles. Okay, uh, Caden, what have you got for me? We'll give you barrier. Ashley? She's our tank here, so let's make sure she gets the protection that she needs. Okay. Oh, let's let's save too. All right, we were going inside here to check this out. Aha! Uh -huh, look at this—a storage locker. They weren't even going to tell us about this. Shotgun, which we don't need. We will reduce that to Omni Gel. This Banshee Assault Rifle. Hmm, I'll take it. Alright, people, let's go.